Let's pull up at this. LaCroix. You're a good helper, huh? What's up, guys? And welcome back to my YouTube channel. We are going to continue our bedroom transformation. I'll show you guys a little update of what we have. But first, this is part two. If you have not watched part one, I'll leave a little card. And don't forget to subscribe. We will be having a part three, most likely. Let me first show you guys what it used to look like. So everything did not match. Everything was different sizes. The bedding was just horrendous. We had like no pillow decor really going on. It just didn't match. It wasn't a vibe. It made the room dark. And now it's starting to make the room wider. So let me show you guys what it looks like now. So there's a quick little update. This pillow right here is new. I just got it yesterday. It's from Target. It was 20 bucks and I think it goes so perfect. Just the perfect amount of contrast in these stripes, I feel. And then here, I think I showed you guys this one on the last vlog, but I stole this one from the living room as well. But you see how it's short? I really wanted to like go over the edge. See? So I am going to buy a longer one and then put this back in the living room. But this is pretty much what the bed looks like so far. It's so much better. So cute, very neutral. And then the mirror, I actually moved it to this side, but I'm still not sure where I'm gonna be putting. Cause look, this is complete natural lighting and it looks great. It looks so great. So I just have to find the perfect spot where the lighting's gonna be good for when I do try on hauls. Cause I'm gonna be using the mirror for try on hauls. I'm so excited to do fashion content. Oh my God, okay. And I don't know where I'm gonna put this stuff yet. So this is like my dresser and I'm gonna be getting rid of this on offer up same with david's black dresser this tv is so old like not even the buttons work but we're gonna keep it because i don't feel like buying a tv that's not where my money needs to be directed in right now but yeah isn't this so cute i love it so much okay so this right here that i have is the bed skirt that i was talking to you guys about because since we use the bottom as storage we want to hide everything underneath geez such a big box for this like what a waste it doesn't come with instructions tailored bed skirt what do i do how does it they're gone oh i think i'm supposed to take off the mattress and put this on and then put the mattress on top. Okay, so we're gonna have to wait on this one. Okay, I'm gonna build the dresser first. We got the cutest dresser. I'm really hoping that it's like how I envision it. It's gonna look, but I'm gonna be switching the bed to this wall and then the door's gonna be built this way. And then after the dresser, we can move the bed back and then we can add this. Natural light gone. So here are the dressers. It's like so dark in our living room right now. We have all the blinds closed. Apparently it came in two boxes and it's so heavy. Let me push this in. You know what, let me move the bed first. We had to get some LaCroix, LaCroix, a uh, tangerine flavor, my favorite so far. Mm. Cheers. So it looks like I could move the bed to this corner. Let me show you guys. There's like space right here. Obviously, I think the mattress is bigger than that, but I'm just going to shove those to the side to fit it here temporarily while we build the dresser. <laughs> Box. What? No, help me. <laughs> David, I'm pulling. Oh, 
back. <laughs> my fingers. Well, that way, I'm gonna good. smash my fingers. Yeah, I'll do it. You want me to pull? No, I'm gonna pull. You're not pulling it. Yes, I am. Hold it. There's stuff in there, right? Mm -hmm. So we have all the stuff laid out now. We're gonna have to start building it with the help of David because I could not do this by myself. I could, but it would just take twice as long. You think when I was single, who the heck built my dressers for me, bitch? Whoa, you can act single now. Whatever. Wally, are you helping? Wally, you're a helper? You're a good helper, huh? The instructions are crap. Let me show you guys if you guys are interested in buying this. This is what you'll have to deal with. The numbers, like it literally is just numbers and that's it. It sucks, but here we are. so much longer they don't come separated so I highly suggest just taking the time to separate everything it'll speed up the process Look at it, it's so cute. It literally took all day, thanks to David. It was a terrible, I don't recommend it. It's absolutely beautiful, but it's very poorly made and very hard to assemble the instructions. So we're gonna put the TV on now. And TV goes on now. It looks so good. This is the view from the bed. We just have to center the bed, but it looks so good, doesn't it? Perfect. What's up guys? It's a whole other day. Whole other day. We ended up taking forever to build the dresser. It got dark and so there was no light in here anymore. So I just want to give you guys a quick update of what it looks like in here and so we can continue with the process and my thoughts on what I'm going to be doing next. Let me show you guys what it looks like now. Alright, so entering into the bedroom. This is the dresser we built. Let me show you a bright, a bright view. This is the dresser we built. It's so gorgeous. I love it. I love that it has, you know, two tones to it. I still need to transfer my clothes from here. And my boyfriend needs to transfer his clothes to here. The bed is looking cute. I just need to add the bed skirt. I want to transfer my clothes out first. And that's pretty much it. Nothing is going on here. These are things that need to go under the bed. And it did drag in my rolling, my hanger. What are these? What is this called? I forgot what it's called. I'm having a brain fart. Oh my god, what is it called? Let me go ask my boyfriend. I forgot. Never mind. I don't have to ask. I remember a clothing rack. <laughs> I bought this a while ago when I knew I was gonna start doing fashion content. I just put it here, but I know that once we move this bed to the center, there's gonna be a lot of space. And the plan was to put a vanity in this corner but I'm thinking I'm just gonna put it in this corner and in the clothing rack and so I don't know about bedside tables and then another update that I changed my mind I was going to add a rug here but I feel like it's going to make the space look too small and I was going to change the curtains because I felt like so you guys I felt like they might be too gray they might be too great, but after everything being put up, they don't look that bad. So I'm not going to spend money and get new curtains if they don't look that bad, you know? I'm going to go ahead and work. It seems like I'm not going to be adding many things after all. It's kind of just like moving things, moving these dressers out, moving the bed to the center and adding the bed skirt because I am trying to keep a minimal vibe to the room. I don't want it to get cluttered, which is why I don't want to add the rug. It's going to start to look smaller. Let's get started. Let's put away all of the clothes. Close first so we can move the dressers out. So this dresser is turning out to be a lot 
smaller than I thought. First thing is this doesn't come out all the way. So it's pretty limited. Like it stops like right here. And we just got, just got used to these deep Ikea drawers I feel. I think I am going to push out just the black one and sell it and then keep the white one against the wall here uh, just because I feel like in the long run we're gonna need more storage for our clothes and put the bed skirt on so we can cover all of this and I'm sure it's gonna make a huge difference. I'm about to show you the final reveal. I already touched everything underneath the bed that needs to go in the bed and everything's ready so let's do a walkthrough. I'm gonna switch to my wide angle lens on my phone. Entering the room, this is what you see. Super white, super clean in this corner. I kept the lamp, it wasn't even moved and I obviously left this light here too. We are gonna be getting like a little a basket to hide the wires. This is the new dresser that we got. I just left it pretty minimalist, which is the goal. Clothes rack right here. And then we have my bomb mirror right here. And then the curtains that we ended up keeping. I pushed this to the corner. That's the corner where I wanted like a mini vanity. Super mini, nothing huge. I don't like clutter. And then here is the bed. The bed is just white. These are like not centered. And I really wanted to get some fluffy pillows, but I'll get that eventually. And then up there, I'm gonna be making a art piece and I'll probably film the video. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Wally's bed, that's pretty much the room. It looks so much better. Alrighty guys, Um, there was supposed to be a part three and part three was supposed to be, in my head there was a part three. I was gonna do just like the little decor stuff. But I honestly like my room the way it is now. It's super like minimal, but it looks clean and I'm very happy with it. So I don't think there will be a part three. I'm pretty sure there won't be a part three. I'm just going to be making the artwork that's gonna be right behind me, right there. And I'll probably just film that, but for the most part, this is it. I am ready to start shooting fashion content and I'm so excited, yay. So don't forget to subscribe so you guys don't miss my next videos and I'll see you guys next week. Bye.